Hey guys, and welcome back to Soma. When we last left off, we had made it to this place, uh, fired up some machinery just outside Omicron. This gentleman's brain burst, um, unfortunately for him, of course, and unfortunately for us as well, because we can't get a reading on him. Um, sad times all round, really. Uh, we just uh, completed this puzzle, which fired up the Jenny here. We should switch this system on. It looks like uh, Omicron, which is the place we need to go, is suffering some kind of qu uh, quarantine, lockdown. But uh, this system that we have here is just sparked back up to life. Um, you right there, fella. Did you do that, Catherine? What? Never mind. I think it's trying to talk to us. Black box status. Everybody's offline. System updates. Update enables black boxes. It's nearly a bloody year later. Um, standard X4B extension. Calibrator. Diagnostic tool for post impact contingency plan. No, stuff needed to make Crane work again. All up to Alan now. Unnecessary security update for the paranoid lab rats. Dead people don't bite. Oh, oh well. Well, they do. They're not really that dead. 28-28. Why don't we get the feeling that we just got lured into the back of a van? Yeah. Come on, Simon. Let her in. Let her in on, on what's just happened. Well, basically, my dear, uh, that weird terminal that kind of obviously wanted to be found has just given us the code. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, we can't use... Can't use the number pad. I'm disappointed. Right, well, that was easy. Um, Omicron retracted the quarantine shutters. Lockdown cancelled. Something wants us to come inside. If yes. we want to go Think? inside, what's the problem? Come on, let's get going. Yeah, Catherine, I, I, I don't think you've really seen what's going on around here. Uh, this thing obviously wants to meet us, and, uh, well, let's just say the last things it wanted to meet us, um, apart from your fine, your fine self, of course, um, they have been overly friendly. Um, most of them seem to want some kind of hug and plug us into the, some kind of mainframe. Uh, some organic matrix, if you will. And, uh, yeah, well, I don't really want that. So this thing seems to be at least smarter than the average goober. Um, is this, this is locked. I guess we have to flood it again. No. Do we not? Oh, of course. Alright, well, let's fill. What's the worst that could happen in Omicron, eh? Probably best not to ask these questions. We know it's something that's going to want to probe us horribly. Let's go have a little look, shall we? Okay, so if I was over, well, I guess I'd be over there. Uh, no. No, that looks bad. If we fall down there, we're going to have a bad time. So, Omicron, where are you? Oh, hey, pal. Oh, there's Omicron. You having a bit of fun up there, my friend? Good, 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 good. I'm glad. I'm glad you're enjoying your, your existence. We could go up there and have a little look around, I guess. Well, there it is. What's up here? 
if anything. Can we get up here? No, oh, it doesn't look like it. We can climb this pipe though. So I wonder what's in this pipe. Ah oh, look, there's more of these droids going around. I wonder what they are. Just little service droids. Uh, if we keep following this pipe, I wonder what we find. That's the thing with this game. You generally never know. There might be something still alive up here. Something's flickering. So, that's a thing. That's just a light. Oh well. It was worth it. It was worth it. And I don't really want to go inside Obercron. There's going to be something big, ugly, and nasty in there, isn't there? It's going to want to bend us over and fill us with um, structure gel, most likely. Which, under the circumstances, isn't a horrible idea, but uh, being forcefully uh, uh, filled with the stuff is a bit awkward. You know? but we're not going to think about that. We're going to think positive, warm thoughts of the Ark. And human interaction. Ah, oh, hey, pal. Hey, come on! Open up! What is this shit? Armor for the apocalypse? Omicron is in quarantine. This is why they didn't answer our call. Hello! Christ, Strasky, it's called a radio. They're not gonna hear you better if you scream. Jonesy, are you okay? Look, I know you're the strong silent type, but I need you to say something every now and then so I know you're all right. Jonesy? Jones. Fuck's sake. Let's try the annex again. Maybe we can break in. We're losing Jonesy. We need to get her inside. Well, get in line! Alvaro, there's nothing we can do for her right now. Hit the stasis switch and let's check the annex. Oh. Oh, dear. Well, fortune favors the brave. Um, yeah, Catherine, this is oh dear, oh dear. This might be the last time we talk. I guess we're not going to talk. Well, at least the pressurizing uh, aspect of this airlock still works. That's good. Oh, offline. Use the alternate entrance. There's an alternate entrance? I guess I spoke too bloody soon. Uh, alternate entrance. What alternate entrance? Ass. Um, like a back door that we could slip into? I guess. If I was an alternate entrance, where would I be? Oh shit! Don't want to drift too far down there. Uh, okay, Simon, I'm I'm not really sure. Let's go for a little wander. Hello, buddy. Hey, uh, you wouldn't happen to have seen an alternate entrance around here somewhere, would you? No, 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 no. Of course, of course not. Of course not. Well. Can't go in through there. Um, we can't swim, sadly, either. Alternate entrance. Well, that's the only door in. Unless we can just can we force the door open, perhaps. Um, no. Well, okay. Uh, shit. Shit. Okay, fine. Oh, I'm assuming that then this path here that kind of obviously looks like a path must lead somewhere? Maybe? I don't know. I wouldn't have thought we've got to go all the way up there. That doesn't make a lot of sense. Hey buddy, I could really use a hand here. 
Something about an alternate entrance. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? I know we've just had this conversation. Well. Now, Simon, I'm not a fan of this any more than you are. This had better be the right way. Yeah. But it's the only other way I can think of. Oh, dear. That's okay. That's okay. It's all good. It's all good, Simon. Stop worrying about the little things, Simon. Stop worrying about the little things. At least if we lose a leg, or I was going to say a testicle, but I don't think we have those, it's not the end of the world, because we're a robot. So, you know. Um... There is something down. Is that because of the pressure, or is there something down here? Either way, we're going to have to be on our toes. Yeah, I'm guessing the pressure down there is too great. Let's get out of here. We've obviously gone the wrong way. Look at that, 50-50% chance of uh, getting the right way, and uh, we got the wrong one. What does that say about us? Oh, I see, so there's this little swanky back door here. Look at that. Alright, well, let's hope this one works, otherwise we... Ooh. Ooh, we're getting a lot of interference here. I think we might be in for some chop here, Sai. We need coffee and we need jungle fever. Jungle fever is a fantastic bait, guys, honestly. This stuff is so Moorish. Let's find that shit. I Ooh, hello. Well. Well, well, well. Something happened in here, ladies and gentlemen. Really, there's a bra here. Well, somebody left with that one. Maybe it's a spare. Oh, with our new body, we could make use of it. I suppose. Depending on how rotten we are. There's a jacket as well. <gasps> Ooh. And it, yeah, we could get duped out here. Could even get a fresh suit. Oh my. People's heads were exploding. Oh my. Oh, I ain't going that way. We're not going to be able to read these people. Yeah. No brain means no reading. Well, we've got two options. Um, containment. Or unknown. Well. We can go upstairs. Or oh, oh dear! Global lockdown active. Override at dive room console. Okay. So, where is the dive room? Oh, we have stuff. Can we open? I guess not. We've got circuit boards and water. Precious, precious water. Uh, what's this? Some kind of spray gun, blowtorch thing. Reels of cable. 
Nothing that we can play with. Got a camera there. Let's try and stay out of the way of those. Although, I don't think we're going to be able to stay out of the way of those. You know. Well, I guess there's only one realistic option. Hello? Somebody uh, want to see me? I don't suppose per chance I could trouble you for a cup of coffee. Yes. I thought not. Right, I'm guessing we're going to have a new foe here. Because every area so far has had a new enemy. Which, as I've said before in the game, I really like. It keeps things fresh. So, what are we up against this time? I actually temporarily lost audio there. Containment F. Hydroponics. I can't hear anything. What? Need to stop it. Stop what? Come on, man. If you're going to talk to me telepathically, that's great. But uh, I'm going to need a little bit more than that, sunshine. Clean room. What are you talking about here? North Hall. Oh, this area is going to be fun. Why do... Um, why do I get the feeling we're going to get lost? Right, so we can go to the North Hall. Oh. They were doing something here. Uh, dive room, yeah. We have no idea where the dive room is, though. Um, yeah, let's keep exploring down here. We're going to run into this thing sooner rather than later, I'd wager. We can't go there. South stair... Oh, hello. South stairwell. Oh, dude. Dude. You really were one with the wow. Alright. How'd that work out for you, buddy? It doesn't look like it worked out that well for you. But hey, what do I know? I'm a bit of a mechanical man myself. So, I'm not going to judge you too harshly. Fuck. What is that? I'm guessing whatever we just saw on the floor... Is going to be our new enemy? Question mark? Medical bay. Would it kill them to put some lights in here? I mean, honestly. Uh, there's the dive room, but it's locked. Storage. Oh, boy. Well, Simon, let's have a little look. Anything in here? Anything useful? Kerosene! Ooh. Oh. We can burn the place down. Well, the drawers are locked. Really? Honestly? Seriously? Unbelievable. Crazy. Why? Ah, never mind. Well, storage has nothing in it. Um... Convenient place to hide, perhaps? What is this? Can't zoom in any more than that. Should be able to. Nope, that is as far as we can zoom in, apparently. Can zoom all the fucking way out through telekinesis, but we can't 
and zoom in. Well, it's 50-something. Let's get that out of the way in case we need to use this room as a hidey hole. In fact, if we're going to use it as a hidey hole, we might want to hide in a corner. That's probably a better corner. Well, would that be a better corner? Let's see. If we're hiding, and we turn the lights off, would be better to hide there. We can actually get in there. Okay, so we can potentially hide there? Question mark. Just leave that open for now. Right. Well, I'm guessing some serious shit went down in here. Ooh. Very nice. Well, at least the bed's empty. That either means um, what's happened has long since passed, or it's got up and having a bit of a wander around. <gasps> We've got pills. Oh, oh yes. Yes, very nice. Medical grade pills. Hydro, that's water, surely. Aspirin. Well, I don't think we need aspirin. Um... More pills. More pills. Okay. I think if you're going in for surgery, you probably want a little bit more than aspirin. Oh, there's some bloody big pills, man. Holy crap. We've got uh, some kind of bag there. Um, more pills. Oh, boots. Ah, some fine looking boots as well, if I if I say so myself. I wouldn't mind a pair like a whoops. A pair like that. So North Hall, we can't go through there. This door is gonna be open. A to Z. We've collected reports. Okay. Oh. Oh boy. Well, this is inviting. Hi there, Mr. All Seeing Eye. <sighs> this doesn't look ominous at all. Not at all. Best behavior now, Simon. Let's try not to upset the locals, if we can. Well, well, I was just about to lock that, but it appears that we've just been bloody locked in. Locked in by what? Yeah, we're definitely not alone here. But is it a human presence or is it? Uh, Wow, but as we already have been told, the Wow doesn't have like a um, traditional style intelligence. It just has a very basic kind of instruction set. Right, come on, cat. What can you see? Huh. Is this Omicron? Yep. Everything is so basic, so limited. I hope it's not the Omnitool falling apart. Me too, cat. Okay, we need to find you a power suit. You know, so we can go into the abyss without ending up like a recycled can of soda? Mm -hmm. You think we'll find one that fits me? I mean, I'm kind of in a suit already. That's been bothering me too. You know how you were transferred from Vancouver? Toronto. From then to now. How could I forget? Okay, so we do it again. You want to send me to the future? No, you no, idiot. No, try and keep up, Simon. Mind into a new body. What? Look, we already know it can be done. We don't need to make it a big deal. It is a big deal, Kath. It's a huge fucking deal. There's got to be something else that can take us down there. But Dunbar at Theta was the only vessel that could take that pressure, and you saw what happened. Then think of something else. Simon, please. You don't have to switch this instant. Just play along for now. If we find something else, then great. If not... I'm not promising anything. Thank you, Simon. Have a look around the room. This is where they would keep the power suits, if there are any left. Hmm. 
See, this whole switching consciousness is very in ah, very interesting. I mean, if we were to swap ourselves into another chip, would we still be us? You know. I don't know. I don't think so. I think it would just be another copy of us walking around. Like, this Simon uh, would disappear. Right? Basically die. Um, even though, I, I guess... I guess they could just copy your consciousness. So this Simon could still endlessly walk around in torment and misery because he can't progress any further. And the new Simon would have all of his memories up until this point. So the new Simon would believe him to be the same one. But the old Simon would know very different. Would have a very different uh, take on it. Hmm. Because we are not the same Simon um, that lived out his life and died in Canada all those years ago. Um, we think we are, and we have all of his memories up to that point. But the real Simon lived a, a very different life and died. Simon, look for a suit in the lockers. Look, I'm trying to make some kind of sense of this. There they are, there's the team. Beautiful bunch of bastards. Yeah, we know that. Power suit tested and ready. Scans are in the arc. Loaded equipment and extra rations. Climber calibrated for weight. Crane. Power suits left. They should be in the lockers. Yes, cat. Thank you. Thank you. I'm examining the resources that we have here. All right. A doomed man is the unprepared man. Well, it looks like we are in luck. D is ready. Uh, well, okay. Simon, look Ooh. for a suit in the locker. Will you be quiet, cat? All right. This is my life that we're we're talking about here. You're fine. You're still that same Cortex chip that I pulled out of the robot. So you're still you, right? Oh. Ah. Nice. I found one of the power suits. There's a dead woman inside. At least I think it's a woman. Just like the body we found in the annex. She's missing her head. Gross. This could work in our favor, though. Look for a terminal nearby. See if you can boot it up. Yeah. Um. Okay. Yeah, sorry, love, but you're about to get evicted. I hope you don't mind. I love the detail in this game. It's fantastic. Um... A high pressure power suit guaranteed to withstand temperatures spanning 50 degrees to minus 75 degrees while keeping a steady 40 degrees default on the inside. The suit will automatically shield the wearer from pressure and maintain the normal 1 AM uh, ATM up to a depth of 500 me 5,000 meters. The onboard controller monitors the wearer's physical state and able to minimize risk of shock, hyperventilation, and even dehydration. Very nice. The suit is easily assembled through rotating the neck and twist rings that lock the gloves and helmet in place. Note that the joints won't seal unless the controller is able to identify a wearer through a set of sensory systems. Suits may be locked to a specific personnel, but by default, the suit will accept anyone. Okay. Well, luckily, this uh, <clears throat> corpse that needs to be flushed, uh, I don't think it has a head, so we couldn't transfer ourselves into it. The controller is the onboard computer monitoring pulse. Oh, the controller is the onboard computer monitoring pulse, brain activity, body temperature, and stress through skin um, conductance. It uses the information to provide the wearer with the safest experience. Excellent. Tracking. 
climber station. All right, and there's Tau. That's where we need to get to. Oh, okay. Error found with suits. Don't radio just yet. Remember what we found out at Theta. The suit you are wearing is basically just a Cortex chip worth a few pints of structure gel, powered by the on-suit battery pack. And a dead colleague, Imogen Reed. Exactly. If you think about it, we're actually incredibly lucky. We found a suit with an already dead body inside. I guess you're right. What about the WoW? What makes you think it'll play along? It's not magic, it's algorithms. A set pattern. The WoW won't be able to deny us, even if it was capable of wanting to. I'm still okay. not crazy about this plan. It feels wrong. Please, Simon. I can't give up on the Ark. I need this to work. So we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, and a battery pack. That's one hell of a shopping list. Thanks. I'll just hang around here if that's okay. I'll be back. Uh, yeah. Famous last words. Well. Okay. So, we have our shopping list. We have our suit. Remote control. Um, we just need structure gel. Should be easy to find. We need a Cortex chip. A little bit harder to find, you know, considering they've all been exploding. There was actually a Cortex chip way back in the beginning of the game. Um, and we need a battery. Uh, battery should... I guess not be that hard to find, but I don't really know. Um, Alright guys, well, I'm going to end this video here. Thank you very much for watching. We have our shopping list. When we come back, uh, hopefully we're going to evict this stiff. And, um, yeah, yeah. Um, take control. All that dead muscle tissue. Mm. Well. Okay. Well, I suppose there's no odds in it, is there? We are basically a robotic zombie. I love that. That's incredible. Till then, guys. Thanks for watching.